at the end of this video you should be able to understand the concept of deterministic and probabilistic model in operation research we often heard that this particular model is in deterministic in nature or some models are there which are probabilistic or stochastic in nature so what exactly mean by this deterministic model and what exactly mean by this probabilistic or stochastic model we will see with the help of one example before that let us see what exactly definitions are so deterministic models are such models which assumes the condition of complete certainty or perfect knowledge whereas the probabilistic or stochastic models are those which consider certain probability of happening of certain event or certain activity now let us try to see the meaning of these two with the help of one example now in critical path method in cpm we have this kind of a network diagram so there are certain activities so there there are activities like a b c d e which are mentioned over here and each activity we assume certain duration so this activity a we assume that it will be completed in 5 days or this activity b will be completed in 3 days and we do all the remaining calculation based on this assumption that these activities will take this certain time so we do not provide any flexibility at this point and we are very much sure that this activity will be completed within 5 days and what will happen if this activity is not completed in 5 days those things we are not taking in account so this is the typical example of a deterministic model whereas in pert for the same activities we consider the three different time estimation so here this three represents the optimistic time estimation meaning that if everything goes right and if everything is in favorable condition this activity will be completed in 3 days if everything is normal it will be completed in 5 days but if the things are going wrong or there are certain issues then this activity may take a 6 days of a duration so we are assigning certain probability to this particular activity and that is why this particular model become probabilistic in nature so it is taking account the uncertainty involved in the activities so this type of models are useful where the uncertainties are involved so i hope that with this example you must have got a clear idea about what exactly mean by deterministic model and what exactly mean by a probabilistic or stochastic model thank you